to the United Center in Chicago. Marv Albert with Matt Duke. Here is Jordan. Yeah, he got the look once again. We were talking earlier about that with Pat Riley, who felt that Jordan received too much room in the game in New York. Bulls 15. And the Knicks 13. Chicago Bulls have won eight of their last nine games. Pippen spot up Puto. And the Bulls lead by four. Still is able to keep it alive. Well, the Chicago Bulls have had two days to, to practice in preparation for this game, but also to practice on their triangle offense, which has been sporadic. Here, the penetration by Michael Jordan drawing the defense. Luke Longley does a much better shot. Not pass that one up. Here's Pippen. Yes. The Bulls 21. And the Knicks 18. And the Knicks do not need a lot of scoring from Anthony Bonner. That's obviously and uh, was actually hitting the shots in the warm-ups, but I know your theory on that one. <laughs> yes. Michael admits that it's a psychological problem for him with this building. Just not comfortable with the rims, the lighting, the background, everything you can imagine. They should either get the old baskets from the stadium or their practice site. Nice move by Derek Harper, one of the Nick heroes. 11 points. Pippen finding Kuko. Once again, Tony Kuko keeping himself active, moving. He presents a gigantic. Anthony Mason getting set to check in for the first time. Starks, yes, and it counts. John Starks able to go glass and the foul. Well, John hit the fir his first shot, a three-pointer to start the ball game. Since then, Michael Jordan has been in his chest. This time, too close as Starks able to get the step and get by Michael, and now the third center in the ball game for Chicago. Oh! One they travel on Starks. Ewing, yes, 13 points for Patrick Ewing, and the Knicks lead by two. And Armstrong and Jordan at the guards. Three-point attempt by Kuko. Jordan on the save, and Jordan with the ball. Well, in transition, Michael Jordan has to throw him out of the way to get that follow-up. Ten points for Jordan. Off the double team. Ewing coughed it up. Armstrong ahead of the field. And the Bulls lead 29-27. Beautiful feed by Tony Kuko. I don't think I'm terrible. Well, it's one thing to have the edge in physical tears as Michael does, but to have a psychological edge as well, that's real something. And the Bulls able to take advantage of the Nick turnover. Scotty is going to roar it back here at the start. Tony Kukoc giving it back to Scotty Pippen. Beautiful ball from by Pippen going right at Ewing. So Smith up front now with Mason as Starks goes to the reverse. It's Smith, Mason, and Ewing to Wellington. What? With a good play to get it to Pippen. And here is Scotty Pippen. Oh, Scotty Pippen is having a sensational first quarter. 17 points. He is in 8 of 9. And every time the Knicks give up a second shot opportunity. Anthony trying to throw the foul. Scotty Pippen on the spin. And the Bulls lead by six points. Now well, Scotty has Pippen for Kerr. Back for Pippen. 23 for Scotty Pippen. Okay, against another with uh, Hubert going up against Michael. Offensively, Jordan guarding Anthony. Ewing with the quick step. Seven point Chicago lead. A foul that felt contact was made on Kerr. Kukos backing his way, went to the spin, it will count, and the foul. And a terrific move by Tony Kukos, but it's really set up by Michael Jordan, who had the low post. And Michael said, go ahead, Tony, he got out of the way, because Kukos had the size advantage against Greg Anthony, and spinning away from the double team. By, by Smith. One for ten in this second quarter. Here's Jordan going to the drive. And perhaps we'll see more of this. Curry. He wants his team to force Michael Jordan to the left. He got his wish here. I'm sure he's not happy with the result. A foul should have been called on the play as well as Patrick Ewing bumped him on the play. But 
The Knicks have been sending just about everybody to left. Pippen has scored doing it, and now Michael Jordan shows that he can score. These guys are professional. Turnover. Pippen for Purdue. Looking to run. Bonner all the way. Anthony Bonner. And it's a 60 straight. Eight of the last nine. Four straight here at home. Michael Jordan. That too easy. Put the move on Starnes. Well, Michael is so ready to spin away from. Now you ain't jumping out on a switch. Nice touch. Time. Right off to the fast start here today. Pippen is rejected by Smith. He's now lead 92-79. They led by as many as 22. It's down to 13 with 705 remaining. Here's Jordan. Fouled by Smith. Jordan did not like the hard foul. Michael Jordan upset with Charles Smith. And let's see what uh, the officials feel about it's a hold it's uh, just a personal foul on Smith even though they're fellow alums I think Michael Jordan getting a little bit irritated now by Hubert Davis putting his hands on him decide he's going to take the young fella to the basket is that what he said something like that Mason backing his way nice move by Anthony Mason and that is his first field goal 93 82 it's down to 11 by the Knicks only setting the pick Williams jumping out on Kuko. Kuko had the shot knocked away. Recovered by Trump, rejected by Smith. Here's Trump again. And the shot So Michael Jordan finally hits a jump shot under dramatic circumstances. Charles Smith and Herb Williams getting so aggressive defensively. One block by Smith, another one on Jordan, and all gets a piece of this one as Jordan has to fade in the deep corner to beat the shot clock. Michael Jordan throwing up the right. Shot clock at eight. Shot clock at two. Mason. Will it count? Yes, it does. The basket counts. And a foul. Chicago Bulls. Certainly remember what Anthony Mason did against them at the Garden in early March. He sparked the Knicks to that comeback. They were 22 points in the lead. At what point do you uh, bring in the likes of Ewing and Starks and Harper? Do you stay with these guys? Well, Hubert Davis cuts it down to 11. It's always one of those decisions. Smart play there by Michael Jordan. Oh, wow. Buddy. Gave up on the fast break, slowed it up, and saw that the Knicks did not hustle back on defense and threw the long pass. To 90. 29 for Scotty Pippen, 28 for Michael Jordan. 